Hello and welcome to a contest of colossal meaning. We find ourselves here just to the north of the Doha city centre, ahead of the 2022 World Cup final. My name is Derek Ray, and with me to provide expert analysis is Stuart Robson. And as you can imagine on this occasion, the atmosphere is building up nicely. It's Portugal, and they take on Belgium. Well, what an occasion for these two sets of players. A chance to be world champions. Let's hope the game matches the atmosphere. It should be an absolute cracker. I can't wait for this to start. Vertonghen. Here's, oh, it was a terrible looking challenge and a big decision for the official here. Well, we've barely got started and he's off, Stuart. Well, it doesn't matter how early it is. It's a reckless challenge and he has to go for that. Short and along the ground. And a no-nonsense clearance. Cristiano Ronaldo, one of the greatest players of the current era, and you'd have to imagine, Stuart, he's going to have some sort of role to play in this one. Well, Derek, he's a great all-round player, but it's his ability to run in behind defenders that makes him such a threat, and when he gets 1v1 against the goalkeeper, he usually scores. And based on that challenge, you wouldn't be at all surprised if the referee reaches for his pocket. Well, it is a caution, and stay calm might be the instructions that should come from the manager. Yeah, you're absolutely right. If they're not careful, they're going to lose another player fairly soon. Well, I think he'll be a bit cross with himself based on that free kick. Not the execution he was looking for. Lukaku. Failed to keep hold of it. Well, the outcome is a free kick here. The clearance wasn't decisive. A smart stop here. Now sending it in. Azar. Well, an attempt to forget all about, unfortunately. Yeah, got it all wrong. Trying to pass it into the corner. Opened up his body, but didn't make the right sort of contact. Well, not quite what he wanted to do with the pass. De Bruyne. Keeping the opposition at bay with that splendid challenge. Well, the attacking options appear plentiful. And credit is due for that good piece of defending. Tielemans. Meunier. And making the run to the inside. Well, it was a foul, but good use of advantage by the referee. Oh, there's the goal! There's the opener! How about that? And so the ball is moving again. Will there be a quick response from Portugal here? There needs to be. Goalkeeper's ball every day of the week. Tielemans. Well, that is how to play advantage. Bad challenge, and now it's up to the referee in terms of what to do next. And that is going to mean a caution. The referee is absolutely right. He knew what he was doing there. How can he take them on and beat them? He went in so dangerously with that tackle. Now, the referee is the man everyone's looking at. And he's been dismissed. This will be a real test of their defensive resilience. Well, he had to go, didn't he? They'll need to reshape their defence quickly here. And fired from the flank into the area. A routine save. Well, at first glance, you would think a strong possibility of a red card. Let's see. And who knows, that might be the end of the story for them in this one. Well, I'm sure you're right. He's just lost his discipline there. It's an uphill battle now. 
Azar. Body on the line. Tielemans. Here's De Bruyne. Bottom a little wasteful in possession. Into the advanced position. But a good piece of defending to bring it to an end. And they could face difficulties here. Lukaku waiting. Oh, good work by the keeper. Teammates available. Meunier. Untidy it was by Meunier. Carrasco. And a shot from some way out. Determined defending. Will he find the net? Now defenders having to cover up. So following the deflection, a corner kick coming up here. But he's gone short with it. And played in. Oh, really good header. But the goalkeeper there's a cover-up. Well, another corner following on from the last one. But it's great when you can rely on your keeper. Well, what a great save that was to keep them in this. May just be the impetus they need, as they certainly haven't been at their best today. Tielemans. On to Lukaku. Well, flinging himself at the ball. And taken short. Really good block. Nice and easy for the keeper. Well, Belgium have really started to dictate the play over the last 15 minutes. Creating lots of chances now, and you think if they do get another, it's going to be tough for the opposition to find a way back into this. Good movement. And based on that challenge, you wouldn't be at all surprised if the referee reaches for his pocket. And following the infringement, a caution. Yeah, no surprise there. That was always going to be a booking. Has eyes for goal! Now the free kick taken, but saved easily by the keeper. And we will have just one additional minute. Hazard. There could be consequences, given that the yellow card was handed out to him earlier. And it is a second bookable offence. That's the end of the story for him. And it doesn't surprise me, Derek. He's played on the edge today. The managers will now deliver their half time. Well, the second half underway with Portugal behind. Can they turn this game on its head? He could really get at the opposition. And having already received a yellow card, he's walking a very fine line. And his day is done. Second yellow card, Stuart. Well, I have to say, it was coming. Why was he not taken off earlier? And now the final whistle. There'll be a new name on the trophy in 2022. That's of Belgium. They've won the World Cup. Well, what a performance. Not just today, but throughout the tournament. They've been great.
world champions. We wondered if this might be Belgium's year, and it is. Well, they've waited a long time. There have been players that everybody expected.